Hello and welcome back to Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup and we are going to try to take on the mighty Pandemonium Lord Minoleg and he can be quite nasty, he's going to summon a lot of these guys for example and they will or can mutate so do have cure mutation in several forms or I mean several potions of cure mutation <clears throat> and the change log for version 0 0.16 only says that Nolag has more and more exciting attack types let's read a magic mapping here <clears throat> this looks like his place. So I'll do what I'll, I've done before. Exclude that area. Clear out the rest. And um, ignore that. Uh, why did I teleport? Okay. Oh, look at this. Yeah. I think I should cure those before going in. Because <clears throat> I think you will also summon. called Necoxex or something they can drain your intelligence and as you can see my intelligence is quite low yeah this guy Necoxex can malmutate and brain feed so okay this teleportitis is fairly annoying Yes, ignore it. I think you can summon a lot of these eyeball monsters, which can, of course, paralyze and be nasty, so... Okay... Well, I think it's time to just go in. This let's cure mutation. Good. Resist mutation would of course be very good here, but I don't think I found a single source of that, so
but by being careful this should work out <coughs> this guy can malmutate so here as possible. Who is summoning? The monstrous Corruptor, it seems. Uh, who is the... This guy. Let's take him out. Yes. Frail, ooh, and icy blue scales, that's good. You expend magic power to slightly strengthen your wands. That seems new, but okay. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Probably gonna have to cure my mutations after this. Anyway. Okay, I have sustainabilities, but only two cure mutations, so <sighs> but we can easily be drained to brainless now. What if I just wait? Store abilities here. If I just wait, <coughs> my intelligence should return. Right? Hmm. 
Oh well. Um, okay, so let's cure mutation then. Uh, I didn't. Oh, it, okay, yes, it cured everything. Even the icy blue scales. Closer now to wherever <clears throat> Noleg is. There he is. Oh God. You can summon eyeballs, malign gateway, and summon horrible things. Fast, extremely dangerous. You may attack to cause random powerful effects, cause mutations, reduce resistance to hostile enchantments, and blink self. Oh my god. Let's get some help. This is going well. Ish. No, oh, it's going well. We kill him, all the summons go away, and we did it! Yes! Ah. Just had to be sure there. <clears throat> this is fairly nasty anyway. Um, I miscast Blink. Shit. Uh, Can't die to this. Fire. Yeah. Oh, there's the rune. Now let's take out these guys. Shouldn't be a big problem. Ta da! That's the glowing rune. The fourth. Pandemonium rune. Nice. <laughs> Look of the sky. Anything down here? Ooh, artifact gloves. So, of course, interesting. Mm. Intelligence plus four, see invisible. Nah. No, 
wanted to go. Huh. Oh, I can spit poison. Uh, I don't think the shining one is a big fan of that. Yeah. So, what? Uh, Berserk. Okay, well, it's not too bad. Let's move on. Uh, And this is the final, final pandemonium lord we have to face. It's Serebov. <clears throat> he is nasty. He has the second highest HP in the game. Powerful fire magic that can cut through fire resistance. And uh, God, oh, Berserk. away <laughs> uh, oh I think it's this your magic feels tainted not sure exactly what it is but let's map out this level These guys are no problem. Cerebo himself.
here. Seven potions of resistance. Should be enough to keep my fire resistance at maximum, even though Cerebo will just cut through. I think he, he just ignores like one point of fire resistance. So if we have three points for him, it's like two. And if you have zero, I think it's like you're susceptible to fire. So. Yeah, this guy's gonna be nasty and <clears throat> might kill me. <laughs> Brimstone fiend here. I can fly over the lava though, so that's okay. Oh, and there is Serebov, demon lord of fire and steel. Dangerous, immune to fire. Yes, fire, storm, haste, iron shot, summon greater demon. Okay. <clears throat> Let's get a potion of resistance going. Let's get some help from a, an angel. gives like one level of minus or susceptibility to fire so He will heal. Oh, he's not at full health. Resistance. Attack him. much. Now there's a brimstone fiend here. 
and berserk okay this could be my chance Yes! Whew, that was close. My god. his sword I don't think we are gonna use that uh, it's unholy so the shining one doesn't like it he has a demon blade oh that was <clears throat> really close and here is the rune haha we have all the pandemonium runes now of nine runes. Demonic glowing. Dark fairy magical glowing demonic. Um. <sighs> I'm just gonna rest here. <laughs> and. <clears throat> oh yeah, there's also loot. Here, all, all scrolls, for example. Except identify. Use it. <clears throat> Money. Well, let's check out this scan mail. Nope.
ornate deck of cards could be good. <clears throat> hmm. I don't know, I'm just curious about this dagger, which is quite cool. Ish, nah, not really. Um, let's get my scrolls back. of war sounds good. Uh, guess I'll never use this. Okay. the way out on this level so Reckless play here, but <sighs> just want to find an exit. Nothing left to do in the pandemonium.
the armor. <coughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'll end this episode <clears throat> after we find a way out of Pandemonium. So there's not going to be much more. You know what, I'll take this exit <coughs> through the abyss. Since we have the abyssal rune, we should find a way out of here quite quickly. And there it is. Excellent. Whew, well, that was the trip to the pandemonium. Wow, this is going really well. And I'm not sure what to do next. Well, there's not much choice really. I'll end this, uh, this episode here and... <clears throat> before next time I'll consider if I'm gonna try to go to hell or not. Okay? So until next time, take care and thank you for watching and uh, 